Yes, people, and welcome to Fight Week. We are in Riyadh, but it is still just Tuesday, which means we have a little bit of time to take in the sights and go and see some shops. And today, we are going to see Jacob and Co. Some of our fighters claim that they are watch connoisseurs. They definitely love a watch or two. So let's see how much they really know. I'm not sure if I can even go in with this. Let's get a proper watch on. CR7, one of the best to ever do it. Right, let's go in. Chris, we're in Jacobs and Cole. You're a watchman, right? I am a watchman, yeah. Houses on your wrist. That's the game we're in. Do you fancy any of them? Of course. Baguettes. It's hard to beat a baguette, you know? There's mm -hmm. nothing quite like a baguette diamond. That's cool. Let's see this one, you know, 300. How? Oh, yeah. 300. 000. Oh, 300. 330, yeah. Worth every penny? Hmm? Worth every penny? Is it worth it? Yeah. Oh, okay. Just checking. <laughs> you got the roulette wheel. That's my favorite Jacob's watch. Oh, that's a bit of you. This, this. I know this watch. One, yeah. My friend Neymar has uh, this watch. Also, he, vis he visits us Neymar here. When we and play poker, we bet. <laughs> yeah. At the poker table, we yeah. bet on the on the numbers on his watch. Before uh, maybe three weeks, he visits us here. Yeah. And he buy many, many, many. What's your number? I think the last time I bet on 13. 13, let you check. Yeah. It didn't come in, I lost like 10,000 pounds or something. Oh, you make a good party. <laughs> we play poker together a lot, and sometimes when we get bored, yeah, go, we'll, 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 do, we'll bet on certain numbers on his watch, and you know, he clicks it, and uh, whenever numbers come in, you bet on certain numbers. If they come in, you win, you bet, and if they don't, then you've got to pay up. 35, my age, it's a good sign. 35 black too. Where's your watch today? This guy knows the game. Uh, like, uh, I, I, I can watch it's cool, like, it's cool, like an easy one. Isn't it? Oh, I keep being late because I don't know the time. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I know all these are gifted. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I, I dropped that out there too. I, was like, I didn't ever pay for what I was being gifted. You had the GMT on before and you took it off. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, you, <laughs> Shh. you took it off. Yeah, you knew. But that's a school boy error, bro. <laughs> I should have worn that. Like, oh, this is a little bit pricey. Just gotta go, man. Maybe, maybe, maybe. maybe, maybe. <laughs> this, these, these are Apple watches. Yeah, yeah. yeah. These. <laughs> oh, no, you know what? What did I say? The guy looking at it. See the guy looking at it. I thought, fuck me. It's been so good. Yeah, yeah. Suits your face. You think? <laughs> I guess it's all. Like it. Guess it's all that. Fraser, would you say you're a, a watch man? Not, not, not really. I, I've got, I like. I do, I've got two watches, and I really like them. One of them was a gift. Um, another one was something I brought for myself. Um, you know, I don't really treat myself that much, but I work hard, you know, and it was nice, nice to get one. But I did like to say with, with these kind of pieces, I just respect like the craftsmanship that goes into something that goes into that. It's nice to look at, of course. I like the box. The box is hard, man. Do you know what I mean? That's here. Yeah. <laughs> also, you can. That's beautiful, man. But obviously, to see these things as well, you know, like if, if if this is what you're into, man, this kind of thing, you know, you you work hard, you, you can achieve these kind of things. That's what you're into. It's not really my bag, but I, I, I definitely respect, you know people that go out and, and work hard to get this kind of thing. Yeah, in bro. That's fucking four hours in bro, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you can buy an estate with it. Look at the up, man. I'm telling you. I'm going to try this one, yeah. Sure, 
That's an engine on the inside. The engine is diamond. Wow. wow! It's the machine car, the Chiron, the 16 engine. It's work same. Oh yeah, that's wild. That is ridiculous. Wow. As far as watches, some of these are. They're worth a lot of money. They, they are. Kids. We're talking houses, mortgages. I mean, <laughs> that Ronaldo one you're talking about. Yeah. What's that? Half a million? Something like that. I don't. I couldn't justify it myself. I'm gonna be honest. You're no telling bent. me the price. I said, take it back off, man. Because if I scratch it or something, might try and do me day. Yeah, that one's sick. Oh, forget that. You know? Ah, yeah. That's great. Yeah, I like this one the best. I like the green. <laughs> The green is also yeah. oh, you got it as well, but yeah. for now what's the what's the range that you'd like to stay in? Uh, 10 to 10 to 20 I'd say. 10 to 20 is okay. But all my watches are gifted so it doesn't really matter. It must be nice. Yeah, it must be matter. very, very, very it nice. Says you with it on your wrist. No, but this is an Apple watch in here. <laughs> In here, this is this is this is worth zero. There are watches in here worth <laughs> 10, 20 of these. Let's go straight into Ben Shalom. We played a game in New York for a watch. This is the watch we won. We've got a couple of days left in Saudi. It's only right. The cameraman was there with me. He saw me win the game. This one right here, yeah, beauty, Cristiano Ronaldo. See, I mentioned Ronaldo. He knows, he knows this game back to a different Saturday. He knows the game. He plays it so good. He knows this game back to a different Saturday. Half a million of watches is ridiculous. I don't think I could justify it. But they are investment pieces as well. So if you put them away, lock them away, it might be more. Don't worse. wear them. Yeah. But when you got that much money, you want to show it off. So, oh man, so. You're walking around with a lot of money. Now nah, you got to walk around with security. You're a boxer. Goes. You're fine. Nah, you're fine. <laughs> fine. Some of these watches are investments too. Exactly. You know, you can, exactly. you can buy a watch in it, you know, in a couple of years. You make 20% on it, 30%. Yeah. Um, so if you're smart in that way, then you can actually you know, make a business out of, of watches. And you get to wear them too. I bought, I bought mine at 32. I watched it go vroom, to 80. I fell in love with it. And then watched it go vroom, back to 32. And now I'm just... Now it's a tattoo. It reminds me of uh, my crypto experiences. Oh, <laughs> Yeah. yeah I've got Sometimes you get greedy, man. Yeah. So yeah. The moral of the story is, if you've made a nice chunk of profit, take it and run. Because, you know, yes, it may go up, but half, most of the time, it's going to go back down. So get out while the getting's good. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I need. That's good. Now I've got PTSD. Right boys, if we just slowly walk behind, we can get out of it with these on, I'm sure. Now see, I think you can yeah, just it. rock me. Nah, just say you need to go toilet, just say you need to go toilet. <laughs> <laughs> no, he thought I was joking. <laughs> <laughs> well, you can't hide, you can't hide. I, I can hide, man, you would never find me. Yeah, I'll take it off, it's too much money to put on my wrist. Yeah. 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 Yeah.